hell there? Any kids that wanna play with my toys? I have teddy bears and no buttocks. So, I have turned off my lights again. And that means I'm ready to play some FNAF. So, you wanna see some FNAF? Today I have five nights of ready system. <laughs> That's really some interesting music. I've not played this one before. So that would be exciting. And you see we have some extras and some custom nine this time. That's interesting. So it looks like it's the biggest FNAF game of until now. It's the fifth FNAF game. After one, two, three, and four. And it looks like it's way bigger than the previous. So that's nice to see that, I guess. So uh, let's choose new game, because we cannot do Daddy, so much more. So why won't you let me play with her? Okay. Oh. Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad in screws, bolts and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we welcome you. I will be your personal guide to help you get started. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Please enter your name as seen above the keypad. This cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Okay, yes, I can see. <laughs> but how did I just have it two at one? Okay. Uh. <laughs> it seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. Okay. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto correct it for you. Yes. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. What? Eggs Benedict? I've heard that before. That's not the first time I hear that one. That in another game, I think. Actually, that's also correct. Another correct trick. That exact name. Okay, so we start like this. Night one. Why is there this propeller going on? It's very. You can now open the elevator using that bright red and obvious button. Yeah. Let's get to work. Allow me to fill this somewhat frightening silence with some light-hearted banter. And Due to the fast. massive success, and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day, and it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually a crawl space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's turn on the light and see if Ballora is on stage. Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. Uh-oh, it looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe that will put the spring back in her step. Shit. Let's check the light again. Oh, really? Excellent. Ballora is feeling like her old self again and will be ready to perform again tomorrow. Okay, now view the window to your right. Good. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to play and share. Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. Not 
Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job. In front of you is another vent shaft. Oh. Crawl through it to reach the circus gallery control module. Okay, so the thing is now Freddy first pair is whatever is close. The fourth one uh, three of whatever is closed again. Motion trigger, circus gallery vent. On the other side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's yeah, check the so light so and see what Baby is up the to. Butts out to birthday parties, like home private birthday parties. Oh, I have one. Looks like a few of the lights are out, but we can fix that later. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up and with also, a control yeah, shock. Kind of a free room game, but there's not much free room to come. You go straight. So there, it's. I have understood it right that you have to walk a bit around in this game, but it's not much, really not very little, and it's not good walking. Oh, we have something here. Can I press this one? I, I, I don't understand what to do. Oh. a mouse that big and I cannot even or when I when I have to press so small things. I don't get it. Well it is from most mostly a point and click game still as you can see. Okay that hurts. But <laughs> Let's try another controlled shock. I just need to shock the lights. Let's try another controlled shock. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. That concludes your duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed, otherwise, you might not come back. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Okay. How do you use the vent behind you? Or is to call back? I cannot go back in the I have to go front again. Motion trigger, circus gallery vent. I think this sound is actually in the new security beats. Another day, another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? All of that and more happening now. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. Upright or upside down? What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. Oh. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you deadbeat. These Will Vlad and his distressed mistress find common ground? Tune in next time. No, oh, can I eat any more popcorn? No, oh, I actually like popcorn now. I am so hungry all the time today. I really want to eat cake and stuff. Why won't you let me go? Welcome back for yeah. another night of intellectual night stimulation, time. pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. We're committed to creating a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. 
Using the keypad below, please select a new companion voice. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for choosing Angsty Teen. No. No. <laughs> An angsty teen, yeah. That's a baseball you can That's cool. So, can I get killed before leaving the elevator? Why is there such a big elevator? And why it's round? And why it's going so long down the earth? As you can see, it's just moving. Do I get my mouse back? It's night two. I get it's night two. The elevator stopped. You know the routine. You can get out now or whatever. That's Stay here if you easy. want. That's more like lazy. So, oh, the wind. Okay, I get it. So, funny story. A dead body was found in this vent once. Okay, okay so it's not that funny, but it's a story. Okay, let's start with your nightly chores. You should check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage, but whatever. Huh, I guess Ballora has better things to do. Let's zap her. That should be fun. Well, let's check on Funtime Foxy. Well, Make working. sure he's ready for showtime tomorrow. Okay, fuck out of here. Great. What? Great. Great. What? What is happening? There seems to have been a problem with the voice synthesizer. Default settings have been restored. Please proceed through the vent ahead of you to Circus Baby's auditorium. Why do I not have to check if they are back on the stage? I'm gonna run because... Motion trigger, circus gallery vent. Circus Baby had a busy day today. Let's check the light and make sure she's in proper working order. Okay, so there's actually some... Oh, Circus Baby, we aren't here to play hide and seek. Let's encourage Baby to come out of hiding with a controlled shock. Let's try another controlled shock. There seems to be a power malfunction that is affecting our ability to properly motivate Baby. Please stand by while I reboot the system. I will be offline momentarily during this process. Various other systems may be offline as well such as security doors, vent locks, and oxygen. Okay. Commencing system restart. Motion trigger, entryway vent. Okay. Funtime auditorium maintenance vent opened. Okay. Ballora gallery maintenance vent opened. I don't recognize you. You are new. I remember this scenario, however. It's a strange thing to want to do, to come here. I'm curious what events would lead a person to want to spend their nights in a place like this. Willingly. Maybe curiosity? Maybe ignorance? There is a space under the desk Someone before you crafted it into a hiding place, and it worked for him. I recommend that you hurry, though. You will be safe there. Just try not to make eye contact. It will be over soon. They will lose interest. Okay, so I have to 
Ich bin halt zu high. Und du bist es. Bleib hier. Is that a good idea? Is it like FNAF 4? Where if you close the door too soon, then when you open it, there will be a jump scare right away. It probably is. That's probably what's happening. How long should I wait? It's just a waiting game. I cannot kind of see out. I can only open it. But if I open it now, do I get a jump scare? Or do I actually have to open it as soon as possible? Oh, I actually haven't closed it all the way. Now I have closed it all the way. I don't want an eye contact. Oh fuck, that was an eye. Okay. So don't look at the eyes, I guess. Oh, that was an eye. Do it smart, I guess. Fuck, I need to see something. Something is in sight. It's in person. Cannot be seen in person. There's eyes. Oh, fuck. Oh, the sound is so realistic. Oh, I don't get it. Oh, it's amazing. to close it off again okay we have no eyes no no oh it's hot Fuck. no I didn't. how are you able to do it no <coughs> no <laughs> it was so hot so hot like the first time you could do it, but the second time you could not. I don't get it. Why is that? Whew. So what? What happens? What do you do about it? Oh, we actually start from here. Okay. <coughs> so you sh oh, freaking hard. Okay, I kind of get the mechanics now. You have to... And it's very hard to explain, but you have to... Uh, oh fuck. Okay, maybe if you make eye contact, they try to open the door. Is that what happened? But I was pretty good at not making eye contact before. Slap on my door. They will try to open the door in a few seconds now. See, the funny thing is, you cannot just take the door and slide it as you want. 
<coughs> the door will slide automatically as long as you hold your button, but you only have to move with the mouse. So this should make it slower, I guess. Yes. And now it's closer. So as long as I hold the button down, I keep slowing it down and at some point they will stop pulling away. When your guide comes back online, he is going to tell you that he was unsuccessful, that you must restart the system manually. He will then tell you to crawl through Ballora Gallery as fast as you can to reach the breaker room. If you follow his instructions, you will die. Ballora will not return to her stage anymore. She will catch you. The power will be restored shortly. When you crawl through Ballora Gallery, go slowly. She cannot see you and can only listen for your movement. When you hear her music become louder, she is growing near, listening for you. Wait. And be still. Okay, that's interesting. Thank you for your patience. It seems that the power system cannot be restarted automatically. You will need to restart the power system manually. Please return to the primary control module. But is he lying about something else? Didn't say anything about motion trigger, circus gallery vent. He didn't say I have to crawl as fast as I can. You will now be required to crawl through the Ballora gallery using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. It is recommended that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. Deactivating. I tried doing it fast. Stop! Okay. So it's true. You should not do it fast. <laughs> You will now be required to crawl through the Ballora Gallery like using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. It is recommended that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. Deactivating. It doesn't really matter. Not really fuck it up too much. When the music gets louder, she's near, but I cannot fall any... You will now be required to crawl back. through the Ballora Gallery using the vent to your Maybe left to, to reach the breaker the room. It is recommended backwards. that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. Deactivating. How long should I crawl? I don't even know. I've not crawled here before. So that's nice. Will I not crawl back? Okay, the music stops when I stops. Nice. Anything. 
but I can see I'm pretty close now. It seems you are taking a long time. Please proceed as quickly and as quietly as possible. Shut up. You're waking her. Do I, do I make a run for it? I can see the door. To stop a lot, we can just just do it in five rows. You have to really listen alone, please. Oh, the surround sound of this is pretty. Taking two more. Fuck. But now we're gonna run for it. Yes. Motion trigger breaker room. You may now interface with the breaker control box. Using the interface may disrupt nearby electronics. If you feel you are in danger, feel free to disconnect the interface temporarily until it is safe to reconnect. Oh. Oh. Hello, Freddy. Getting jump scared. Pretty soon, I can feel that. Shit. Oh, that's how it works. So we can restart one thing at a time, but I have to hold it down. Okay. So Freddy can get quite angry if you restart. What? Okay. He's back again. Stinger that it was so high. Oh, 
finger they will spill. Okay, take one at a time, like, bye. be required to crawl through the Ballora Gallery oh, using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. It is recommended that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. Deactivating. Tick, tick. I just run for it until I hear the music. It seems you are taking a long time. Please proceed as quickly and as quietly as possible. Exactly where she is. Now let's get how long it takes to go away and it's really long this time. Okay. 
it takes a long time. Motion trigger breaker room. You may now interface with the breaker control box. Using the interface may disrupt nearby electronics. If you feel you are in danger, feel free to disconnect the interface temporarily until it is safe to reconnect. Calm down and go back to sleep. No one is here. Takes so long. I have to do it eight different times. Everything is okay. Let's go back to sleep. It, it's just a patience game. Like, it's the same thing I have to do every time in the game. Like not having much more. The only thing that can happen is that I'm doing it wrong. I do there. Go on up on the stage. That's good. Right there. Stay there. Great job. This completes your tasks for the night. Please proceed back through the Ballora Gallery with care, and we'll see you back here tomorrow. Oh, sure. Of course, I have to do this shit again. Is someone there? I can hear someone creeping through my room. Perhaps not. Yes, I did a night too. A FNAF game, amazing. <laughs> First time here. As the sun sets, so also does another chapter in the saga of love lost between Vlad and his distressed mistress.
Can they be reconciled? Can their love rise again? That and more happening now. Clara, the baby isn't mine. It is, Vlad. They had trouble catching him in the nursery today. So what? Lots of kids get hyper and run around and stuff. They had to knock him out of the air with a broom. I have to go. They're going to dock your paychecks. They can't do that. I'm a vampire. I don't get paychecks. You work the graveyard shift at the Fry Me Taco. Don't Is lie to me. Achievement for oh, you. the humanity. When will the heartbreak end? When will these two ships passing in the night rekindle their long lost love? Tune in tomorrow to find out. Seriously seeing animatronics all over the place. Welcome back to another pivotal <laughs> night of your thriving new career, where you get to really ask yourself, what am I, I doing with my life? What would my friends say? And most importantly, will I ever see my family again? We understand the stresses of a new job, and we are here for you. To help you reach a more stable and relaxing frame of mind, we offer several musical selections to help make this elevator ride as relaxing and therapeutic oh, yeah. as possible. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. And Using the keypad below, please It seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for selecting Casual Bongos. Now that your elevator experience has been customized to your needs and you're thoroughly relaxed, it's worth mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. Please enjoy the rest of your descent. Has taken their elevator ride thing from this game. It's quite funny to play all the old because you can see where the new security breach has taken their elements from. It's really like a combination of all the other flaps. Okay, so uh, do I have to press the button? Now? I think it will tell me. Tell me to do stuff. Tell me the elevator right button. And what now? I have to press this thing. Due to unforeseen malfunctions from today's shows, your nightly duties will require you to perform maintenance that you may or may not be skilled enough to perform. It became necessary for technicians to attempt to disconnect Funtime Freddy's power module. However, they were unsuccessful. Allowing them to try again would be an inefficient path forward, as we would need to allow six to eight weeks for recovery and physical therapy. You will need to reach the parts and service room on the other side of Funtime Auditorium to perform the procedure yourself. Yes. Let's check on Ballora yes. first Ballora. and make sure she's on her stage. Great, it looks like everything is as it should be in Ballora Gallery. Let's check on... Great, it looks like everything is as it should be in Funtime Auditorium. What? There is no what? need to check on Baby tonight. Please refrain from entering unauthorized areas. Proceed directly to Funtime Auditorium. How do I know which one is the right one? Funtime Auditorium maintenance bin opened. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate. Oh, fuck, fuck, shit. Why didn't you say so? You didn't tell me that they could jump scare me now. You, you don't, don't you have time to tell me what to do. What the fuck? It was dark all the way.
That's unfortunate. It was not even on purpose. It was just really slow to move after I jumped. <laughs> Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark, as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Just fuck it up. I can hear myself fall, but I cannot see. Okay, I can still use it this time. Funny. <coughs> oh, fuck you! Oh, this is the worst one yet. Because you don't know shit about it, it just comes out nowhere and you're just seeing this darkness. So what is Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark, as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Flashlight instructions disappear for some reason. It's probably a bug that just isn't this good. Ah, I can't even hear. I cannot see a shit. I just move very slow, that's my tactic. If I move slow, nothing will happen. Motion trigger, okay. parts and service. Great job reaching Bye. parts and service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order, and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just no. under his right cheek, and press it. That one. Great. Now locate the button under his left cheek and press it. And I know Great. Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. What? I cannot see a button. 
button. Where the shit is the button? Oh! Great! Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Oh! I hate these. Good job. The faceplates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. What? On the underside? Oh! Excellent. The chest cavity should now be open. Remove the power module from the chest cavity. Great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Large what button? Under his coat. Totally gonna jump scare me now. It should be a last button under his bow tie. But it's not this. So I cannot see anything. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Bonnie's is that funny? Bow tie. Oh, okay. Why is that happening? Okay. How the fuck? Should I press Bonnie's bow tie? When Bonnie is fucking around all the time. Fuck sake, Bunny. Come on here, Bunny. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Motion trigger, parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. 
It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order, and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. Great! Now locate the button under his left cheek and press. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Good job! The face plates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Excellent! The chest cavity should now be open. Great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Okay, I have to make Bonnie sit on his hand again. I'm pretty sure that's it. Go away. Go away. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. I don't know what the tactic is. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. It's really nice to be out here. There should be some sequence. supposed to do that oh my god I don't get it Okay. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark, as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. 
However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. See if you can do it with me just like going forward and nothing else. Okay. Motion trigger, parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order, and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. What happens if I do this? For clarification, please note that I am referring to Freddy's right, not your right. For, clarif for clarification, please note that I am referring to Freddy's right, not... Great! Now locate the button under his... Great, now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. Great! Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Good job! The face plates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Excellent. The chest cavity should now be open. Remove the power module from the chest cavity.
great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. to do something I think I think Funtime Auditorium maintenance been opened Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her You have been provided with a flash beacon Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room.
maintenance bin opened. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Exactly, better to not just not use the flashlight at all. Birthday Monitorium maintenance bin opened. Unlike Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. Motion trigger, parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should make your job much easier. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order, and it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it.
Okay. Oh, I think I'm ready. We got. I have the guts to do this. Bonnie is here. We cannot click the button yet. I'm pretty sure. Great. No. Now locate the button. On Great. Now carefully locate and press the. Great. Now carefully locate and press the button just. Good job. The faceplates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Excellent. Great work. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. nice I guess so we do it again he's there fuck that was not fast enough you have to go really fast I thought you have to actually keep it slow Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. He's rising. Oh, I clicked it. Great job. You've acquired both power modules. This completes your tasks for the night. Please exit the building through Funtime Auditorium, and we'll see you back here again tomorrow. No, I was doing it so nicely. Daddy, she can make balloons. Why? No, Have I you don't seen know. her make balloons? Oh, Daddy, let me go to her. What is that? Shh, yeah. be still and quiet. You've been sleeping for quite a while. I think they noticed that you never left the building last night. The cameras were searching for you, but they couldn't find you. I have you hidden too well. I kidnapped you. What? Okay, so it actually goes to night four. If you die, the last part, but you, you are like inside. Don't be afraid. Metronic. I'm not going to hurt you. I am only going to keep you for a little while. Okay. Try not to wiggle, though. You're inside something that came from my old pizzeria. I have wiggled. I don't think it was ever used. At least not the way it was meant to be used. Too dangerous. It's just big enough for one person to fit inside, but just barely. You're in the scooping room. Do you know why they call it the scooping room? It's because, dummy, this is the room where they use the scooper. I thought that would be obvious. Isn't that a fun name for something? The scooper. 
It sounds like something you would use for ice cream, yeah. or custard, Sorry. or sprinkles. It sounds like something you would want at your birthday party to ensure that you get a heaping portion of every good thing. I wonder, though, if you were a freshly opened pint of ice cream, how you would feel about something with that name. Thankfully, I don't think a freshly opened pint of ice cream feels anything at all. Uh-oh. It sounds like someone else is in the building. Shh. There's something very important that I've learned how to do over time. Do you know what that is? How to pretend. Do you ever play make-believe? Pretend to be one way when you are really the other? It's very important. But Laura never learns. But I do. They think there is something wrong on the inside. The only thing that matters is knowing how to plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Like this game has kind of multiple endings and ways of processing the story. Okay, so that's how you get killed. Where do I start from? Do I start from this crazy night four or do I start from the place in night three? Well, oh, I actually start from here. Okay, so now I have to do this. I'll open the face plates for you. And that way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. Oh, I can reload. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. So now I have to wait. You don't. <laughs> what? So this time it was faster.
I don't get it, you can only do that much, so how do you do it? Look, so pretty sure I didn't have to do this if I was not going I'll to die. I'll open the face in plates sleep. for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. So, now this all you have to is do is another wait. way of getting through nightfall. I'd recommend I that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing so them to come there loose. There is probably multiple endings to You this don't story. want them to get too loose. Trust me. Can you click on them? Oh. Same way I died the other time I got this long. It's the longest I have gotten now is two times. Okay, so this. I'll open the face for uh, you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. Isn't there two up here too? So we actually. I'd recommend that you five. keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. that loose is not when they are out because I can see they are moving out when I click on them but apparently that is not what loose means loose are when they get inside okay so red is 
bad, I think. But how do you know? The good thing is it's not scary at all. It's just annoying. I'll open the faceplates for you. Losing. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. purpose do we have to recover it i just looked at all of them Open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me.
it die if you were too long? Open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Okay. Now all you have to do is oh, okay. wait. You actually have to hold it. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Turn it a bit too much, I think. I have to turn it a bit this. This is not lucky. Somehow get jump scared, but don't go ahead. So and now, whilst the min arena on the right is climbing up, when he is about at your head level, you'll yeah. notice the one on the left side will also start climbing up. Is it now your chance to knock out two birds with one stone? Start shaking your suit using A and D, but keep the shaking to a minimum. I'll open the face plates for you. That way, they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. last time or too little I don't even remember what I was thinking I think I did it too little
do it with 12 power plus like three times this time. So the first three times here. Yeah, sense for me. Function. The knobs will be going down slightly faster now, but try to get them as close to 12 o'clock as possible. It should still be doable at round two. The only real difference with Moe's for round two is that there will be mini arenas climbing down this year as well as on the sides. Just ignore them. Once you shake the two mini arenas climbing up the side, you may proceed to round three. Round three is the exact same as round two, so just repeat what you did there, but it will be almost impossible to equal the knobs at 12 o'clock. So put them all to around two o'clock and you'll I'll open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me.
last one. I died on the last knob because I went too far on the lift. Okay. I'll open the face plates for you. Don't make mistakes anymore. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. Oh. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Fog off. This round are kind of really growing now when you have like just played the fifth round. You have to twist and hold it so long. You feel like you will get so stressed. Oh, you can actually wiggle when you are holding it down. I should have known that. That will spare me a half a second. That is quite nice to know. Why there's so many red one? Last time there wasn't more than one red on the left, but now it's really bad. Must have been too slow or something. I have to do something with the mouse pad. I keep moving it around, so no. Now it should be fine. Open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come Maybe loose. I'm too long. Maybe you I don't start want them to get too loose. Earlier? Trust me.
Why is that happening just too fast? I know I fucked up a bit, but not fucked up that much. too long. I'll open the face plates for you. That way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. This one now is freaking. Don't have so many signals on this. Just round them all up to 12. There was no red one. I'm so sure it makes no sense. I knew it was fine. Okay, so now I'm gonna try the new function. Leave the game. Yes, okay, and then just close it up. Totally. Just kills it. That's fun. So, okay. So, how long? How long has it been? How long has it been? I don't know. It would be fun to see where to start when you open the game again, if you start the exact same place or how that works. However, yes, uh, I'm gonna stop it here for now. I'm gonna turn back to that game, that's for sure. Just not today because I got too much of it. It was the same thing all the while. And it was too much not working as I want to. And I, I don't really get why I don't win the game. I was so close and nothing really went wrong, to be honest. But I hope you liked the video. If you did, like it and uh, well, subscribe if you want to see more of this. Now I want to play uh, FNAF Security Beach, the newest one for now. 2021 the 2021 one yes and uh, if you want to see that click at the link in the video it will be there the part one at least and uh, you can see my first try at that game and else i guess i see you in the next one